seconds. Hey everyone, it's Al Tricasso. Today I'm going to do a video that may seem partisan, but it really is not partisan at all. So I'm going to ask all Americans, conservative, progressive, Republican, Democrat, whatever political stripe you have, to listen to this urgent message. And after that, I want you to share it with all your friends that you can imagine sharing it for, with around the globe, really, through YouTube, through Facebook, you name it, Twitter, and any other social network. You see, this has to be heard because you're losing money. It comes down to that. You're getting robbed, actually. That's the real truth. So um, what's all this about? Well, here it goes. And by the way, if I chose to be partisan, which I am not, I will remind my colleagues in the, the uh, conservative side of politics that Karl Rove said, when appropriate, he will be partisan. Well, if there's ever been a reason to go that route, this is the reason. But I'm not going to. As a matter of fact, I want to hear feedback from you at my email address, actoraj2, the real number two, at gmail.com. But check this out. I want to tell, talk to you about Congress. Ah, don't turn it out. Don't tune out. Don't turn it out. Don't shut it off. It's not going to be one of those dry, boring videos. Come on. It's me. At any rate, listen. Every member of Congress makes at least, at the very least, $174,500 a year. They also happen to get free, government subsidized by you, and government run by the United States Navy, health care. Oh, you didn't know that about the conservatives in Washington talking about Obamacare. You didn't know that? You didn't know that those very same men and women are actually doing what they don't want for you and tell you not to get? You didn't know that? Oh, damn, I thought you knew that by now. Yeah, check out the office of the, the, the attending physician. Not only do these guys and girls get to have free health care run by the United States Navy, but they actually get house calls actually in the Capitol building itself. That's right. And they actually don't ever, ever, ever have to worry about paying a copay. And you want to hear something else? They don't ever have to worry about co-insurances. They don't pay for medicines or anything. And you know what? You might think, well, I bet you they pay a whole lot of money for that. No. Nope. If they pay anything, it's $503 a year. You didn't know that? Oh, come on. You had to know that by now. But actually, you can check the facts. That's a fact. So the very men and women that say that Obamacare and government run and government subsidized health care is a terrible thing. And it's socialized medicine. Why isn't it socialized medicine when they use it? Why isn't it a bad thing when they use it? You might want to ask House Speaker John Boehner and you might want to ask people like Eric Cantor or any of these people who, who say it's a terrible thing. But that's not about Obamacare today. That's just a little extra icing on the cake that I thought I'd throw at you. It just shows that they're such a hypocrite that they're a joke and a half. Except that it's very sad. But at any rate, here's what I'm going to throw down. So get ready for something to throw down. These guys make $174,000 get free health care and they're guaranteed a pension of at least a million dollars as long as they serve two to four years in their term. Well actually two to six years. If you're a congressman or woman it's a two-year term. If you're in the Senate it's six years. They do one term, one little old term, they're guaranteed a million dollars pension and we get to pay for it. Ain't that wonderful? Ain't that just great? Aren't you glad that you have to struggle? But our congressmen and women, they have a million dollars waiting for them. But at any rate, hey. Ain't that ain't fair. No, it ain't fair. But at any rate, that's not even what we're going to talk about today. You know what we're going to talk about? They're getting $174,000 a year. They're getting paid every day. And we have a house 
that has a Republican majority, not partisan, it's called evidence, it's called fact. A House majority that has become a do-nothing Congress. That's right, it's called a do-nothing Congress. But check this out. Instead of making this video be really, really, really long, I'm gonna go ahead, be quiet for a few minutes, 20 seconds, cut this video, and we're gonna go into the next video, and then Annette's gonna put some extra icing on the cake. But before we do, keep one thing in mind. Everything that I tell you, I want you to check the facts. Go on the internet, go to your library, find out if there actually is an office of the attending physician. Go check out the salary of at least $174,500. And by the way, that's just for normal members of Congress. If you're the Speaker of the House, if you're the minority leader, if you're the Senate majority or minor, I mean majority leaders, then you make over $200,000. In fact, John Boehner, who's a do-nothing leader, guess what? He's making over $224,000 a year of your money. But I'm gonna leave you with that. John Boehner, you may be the most conservative person in the history of America. He's stealing your money. I got up because I thought you were.